So today we can discuss this question from Code Forces contest educational Code Forces round 86 problem A road to zero. So you are given two integers x and y and you have to perform two types of operations. We can pay either a dollars and increase or decrease any of the integers x or y by one and they can be four cases you can like initially x is 0 y is 7 so you can decrease y you can increase y decrease x or increase x or you can pay b dollars and increase or decrease both the integers by one so they can be you can decrease both integers or increase both integers and you have to make your goal is that both the integers become 0 simultaneously that is x equal to 0 and y equal to 0. There are no other requirements. Okay. But as you can see in the constraints x and y are both greater than 0. So we don't need to increase we just have to decrease our x and y. Okay. So if we take this example and we have to bring both them down to 0. We can first make both of them equal. So how we can make them equal? It is better to make the greater than equal to 5. So there is only one way to decrement. If we have to decrement 1. So there is only one case. You have to pay A dollars. So how many A dollars we have to pay? We have to pay the greater one minus the smaller one. Which is 2. So uh, we have to pay 2 A dollars. And then we bring both equal to 5. Okay. So now. There can be two cases. We can decrement both by the operation B five times because B decrement both the numbers by one, or there can be a case such that the value of 2a, 2a is if you decrement this by one and decrement this by one, we have totally spent 2a dollars. So, such that let's take an example of B is equal to 10. And a is equal to 1. So if we decrement both of them by 1 by spending 10 dollars we can what we can do either is spend 2 dollars decrement this by 1 and decrement this by 1 so this will cost us least less money. So or we can do is 5 into b or 2a into 5 which is the same we can use b or 2a which is either one is small and we can bring them both down to zero at the same time. I hope you understand the logic. So that is simple logic which can quote it out easily. So the code is we have to first take C input. We do a while loop and then can take everything in long long x y a b c n x y a b okay then we can make sure if x is greater than y we can swap them which ensures that x is always the smallest one among the two so if x because we can swap these positions we know we have to bring them both down to 0 but this operation makes us sure that x is the smaller one so because now y is the greater one so we have to first make a total equal to 0 what we can do is we have to increment y minus x because we have to first bring down y to the value of x so to total is this this is y this is x so y minus x into we have to pay a dollars because there is no other way to bring the greater one greater one to the smaller one okay and then we have to check if 2a 2 into a is smaller than b so this is this, this is smaller so we can add total plus equal to x into 2 into a else what we can do total plus equal to x into b and finally the short check it
much accepted. I hope you understand the logic. If you still have any doubts, please mention down. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.